Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park Toledo, located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this 2015 Toyota RAV4 Limited. Now the most suitable features on this Limited model is its power liftgate. You also have your navigation system as well as your heated front seats. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this 2015 Toyota RAV4 Limited. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this limited model is its daytime running lights. You also have your fog lamps and then if we take a closer look just over on the side here, you have your 18 inch aluminum alloy wheels. Now you also have your foldable mirrors as well as your integrated signal lamps, vortex generators. And the other nice thing is you do have the smart key system with it. So with the smart key system you can lock all the doors simultaneously just by pushing on the two little lines you see there on the handle. Push on it once, it'll lock all the doors automatically, and then if you put your hand between the handle, it'll unlock the front door for you as well. Now this is all possible just as long as you do keep the key fob on you at all times. And the color we're going to be taking a look at today is silver. Now to start off with, we're going to be taking a look at your front dash as well as your front seats, just so you have a much better idea of how much space there is. Now you have your black leather into your seat surfaces with your power driver's seat with lumbar support. Taking a look just over on your left hand side, you're going to see your traction control on and off, all wheel drive lock, power lift gate release, you also have your mirror controls, and then on the inside of your driver's side door you have your seat memory controls for your driver 1 and 2 along with your window locks, power locks, and window controls. Now a couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your volume control as well as your scroll function, Bluetooth voice recognition display, and your cruise control. Now you do have that push button start so all you have to do is put your foot on the brake, hit the push button and it will start up for you automatically. Now taking a look at the multi-informational display you're going to see a couple of different options on there which include your odometer reading, exterior temperature gauge, and then if you hit the display button just on your steering wheel there. You'll be able to see your trip info as well as a couple of other additional features. Now taking a look at the center dash as well as the touch panel display you're going to see a couple of different options on there which include your hazard lights, you also have your digital clock and then if you go inside your apps menu you'll find your navigation audio phone as well as a couple of other additional features. Now you do have the dual zone climate control settings and underneath you'll see your eco mode, sport mode as well as the heated seat controls for your driver and passenger, window wiper de-icer, USB and auxiliary input and your two power outlets. Now it's mounted to an automatic transmission and if we take a look now just at the very top you're going to see your auto dimming rear view mirror and a couple of the controls you'll see up at the very top here include your integrated garage, uh, sorry, your uh, open and close and tilt up and down feature for your power moonroof. Now if we take a look just at what your backup camera is going to look like, I'll just throw this into reverse for you. As you can see you have those nice guiding lines in there making things much easier for you when you're trying to back into a stall. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your tailgate. Now located on the back of your tailgate, you'll find your backup camera just on your left hand side and your rear hatch release located just underneath your Toyota emblem. All you have to do is push on the button once and it will open up for you automatically. Now taking a look at your rear cargo space here, I'm just going to close in on it for you. But as you can see, if you do need the additional space, you can fold down that 60-40 split rear seat. You also have some storage space located underneath the floor at the very front there just so you can hide away some of your valuables and if we take a look just underneath the floor you'll find your spare tire as well as your jack and tool kit so if you do find yourself in a bit of a pinch you know exactly where it's located. Now the other thing I like is that you do have that power adjustable tailgate so in the event that you do need to readjust the height for yourself hold down the button for approximately two seconds at the height you'd like it at. It'll beep a couple of times and when you close it and open it again it'll open up to the site for you. However if you do need to reset the height for yourself hold down the button for more than four seconds it'll beep several times and when you close it and open it again it'll open up to the maximum height for you. A couple of the uses for that power tailgate is if you're a little bit shorter or if your garage is a little bit lower you can prevent the back of your tailgate from being damaged. Thank you so much folks for watching this video today if you have any questions on this 2015 Toyota RAV4 Limited 
please visit us. We're located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. The phone number is 780-410-2455. Or please visit our website at sbtoyota.com to get us by email. Once again, folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day, and I hope to see you next time.